when we're hot and we're sweating, we are losing electrolytes. However, the question remains whether we need those electrolyte drinks that are out there. They've, uh, they were invented, you know, I'll say specifically Gatorade because it was invented by somebody on the staff of the Florida Gators, the team that was practicing outside in the Florida heat for hours and hours a day. Mm. And they were losing way more electrolytes than you or I spending a day at the beach or even exercising or being outdoors. Electrolytes refer to, here, here's some of the basics, and you have heard of them, sodium and chloride, which together oh, yeah. make up salt, sure. magnesium, calcium. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. These are these are all electrolytes. Uh, potassium as well. All right. So people can tell when they are depleted in electrolytes. Uh, for example, low magnesium can cause muscle cramps. It can oh. cause dizziness. It can even cause heart arrhythmias, little extra beats or or feeling. Uh, it, it does not feel good. So when you're doing exercise, even if it's indoors, mm -hmm. uh, we are losing electrolytes. People are not all the same when it comes to losing electrolytes. For example, with, even with just sweating. So some people sweat more than others when they are exercising. And there was even something that I learned that's called salty sweaters. So people know who they are. So you're, you're someone who sweats and you can tell that it's really particularly salty. So mm -hmm. that actually is uh, sodium and chloride being excreted in the sweat that does need to be replenished. The question, you know, it's still not so good to go for a sugary Gatorade type of drink.